I want to show you how to stay organized during this honors project. So the first thing you're going to do is go to your Google Drive. Then we're going to come over to the left here where it says new. You are going to create a folder and this folder you're going to name honors. And then probably lit comp in case you're doing other honors projects. And we will push create. Once you have this folder, which is highlighted right here, we're going to go into the folder and we're going to make sure that we share our settings. So when you go to this button here, it's going to allow you to share with people. So you need to open up these sharing settings for your teacher. There's two ways to do it. You can add your teacher's name. So maybe I want to add Miss Burns here and I want to allow her just to view. So you can just add your teacher that way. The other way is you can click this and you can change this so restricted to anyone in the Beaverton School District or maybe you even want to open it up and anyone with the link if you're going to be sharing anything with people outside if you want anyone to see that that way. And then here you would copy this link and this would be the link that you could submit to your Canvas assignment or you can just share with your teacher. You always want to check with your teacher and ask how they're collecting it to make sure it doesn't get lost. And now your whole folder is going to be shared. Now you have the honors presentation that we have already shared with you. And on slide two, it has each of the assignments that you're going to need to do. So each of the assignments is linked and I'm going to click on this, which is going to ask me to force a copy. Yes, you want to make a copy of this. So I'm going to make a copy here and it's going to come into my copy of honors brainstorm, but that doesn't mean it's quite in my folder yet. So once you're here, we are going to go to our file, then we are going to go to move because we have it just in our Google Drive right now and we want to make sure it is in our honors folder. So we're going to scroll down till we see our honors folder here and we are going to click the move button. So it says it's going to make it visible. Yes, that's what you want. You want all these documents to be visible by your teacher and anyone else you'd like to share with. So we're going to move it there. And then you're going to do that with every single one of these. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of these documents. You're going to want all of those documents in your honors folder. So here, if I go look at my honors folder, I already have all my copies. You should have your nine documents here. And then as you work through this honors project, all of your work is going to be right here in this folder so that you can share it with your teacher and anyone else you'd like.